because I'm back here in the motor. I might have to reposition the pump some, but this is the cataract rolling. That's Nick and his little bitch boat, his little hot rod. dredge we're gonna play around right here just to test everything but we gotta we're practicing setting up without touching the ground pretty much so we're out here in the middle of the river right Nick's got to get the hose tied on the one end so we can throw the other out and still be able to grab it without any of us falling off ladders in the water it's kind of okay we'll see there's a big rock right there it's probably hitting This is our wreck of a boat. Nice looking gravels in there. We'll see what comes hey, push out. Push yep. the suction hose forward some. Towards you? Yep. Ugh. Need a little more wiggle wiggle. Maybe a little bit more. Come on. I'm trying to get in the clamps, clamps. Cause we're in a world of OSHA violations. <laughs> As the whole boat's picking up on the one side there. Yeah, I know. Yeah, you going over on that side. It just yeah, we can't both be on the same side at the same time. I just watched it drop like six inches and I'm like, oh no, we're going Did your feet get wet? Yeah. Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> I wasn't worried about the feet, I was worried about my face as long as I was kissing the water. Well, the motor too. Yeah. I don't know, we might have to motoring up here as i kind of tried to show is a little close to the water i'm not sure if we're gonna to have to try and reposition these the the pumps over here further which might mean i need longer high pressure hoses um not sure yet gotta we'll get her up and running and get it figured out and play around with some this is the inaugural test run of the cataraft dredge here in the beautiful somewhere in the united states North Carolina. Uh -huh. Yep, North Carolina. Beautiful area though. We'll see if we get any gold. Saw just a coyote up there around the rapids just a couple minutes ago. You get it figured out? If I were you, I'd be more afraid of them coyotes. <laughs> I forgot what to hook to. There's frames all around you, man. Alright, shoes work. Yeah, that's a scary looking thing. Okay. Well, throw the goose poop hose into the water. Is this nozzle attached? Because it came off once. Oh, yeah, it did, didn't it? <laughs> uh, yeah. I don't know where I have a wrench for that. Flat head. I'll flatten your head. I think my flat head on here is broke. Useless. File. Yeah, I think it's a flat head. Yeah, hopefully we don't run into Megalodon here in Idaho. Nick's scared of them 10-foot sturgeons, too. I want to see a big fish. 
I should be the biggest thing in the water. Whee! Sink, bitch. Uh, well, that's something for Idaho we're going to have to figure it out, is it's going to need, when we throw it out, it's going to need a tether. Well, not necessarily. Just when we go, we're going to have to have a tether dangling. So when we're done, you can swim back under the cataract, get the uh, tether, and hook up to the nozzle so we can pull it back up. Okay, that's done. Let's, uh, let's see if these guys get into the water or not. I think that hose is in there. I guess we'll find it out. It should be okay right now. What I would do, though, is I would get another one, Nick, yeah. and I'd attach another one further out so it doesn't do a big kink or bend right gotcha. there where it is. Uh, you need another one? Well, you just think of another one. Get another one. And another one. I can't reset. Jeez, make some more walking room for me. <laughs> See if that one fits. Oh, well. we'll be back as we get set up here a little better and get running. Well, we're up and running. Uh, it took a little bit, but yeah, she's running. Uh, definitely gonna require some modifications here and there. Right now, the engines are vibrating those bleachers and it's obnoxiously loud. So that's gonna need fixed. For some reason on the pro line loose here, which is generally structural, it seemed like it was flexing and bending and we couldn't get angle until I added a bungee or a uh, tie down under there to lift the center of it up. I don't know why it was flexing so bad. Uh, yeah, that wasn't any good. I had to fix that. Uh, had to fix a couple things. Some of the engines and stuff. I gotta get those, I think, mounted a little better.